Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back. We are going to be continuing uh, library chase now. So let's go ahead. We got to go up here. I still what need to read. I got to get to Will. Oh, fuck! <sighs> shit, shit. Oh, shit. Enemy spotted! Shot. No, 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 no. Go, go, go. I can't use... Oh, shit, I can't... Oh, God. That's my bad. I, I forgot. You can't use it. You can't use it like you can later in the game, where you hold it down for the movement. Okay, that's my bad. And right now, you just died. Oh, shit. I might have some... Now this whole like beginning part where they're What the fuck is going on in there? You asked for it. We're moving in. Go, go, go. You two just lined up to get sprayed together. Thank you. Got to get to the library. That's where they're taking him. It's fast. What? You still had no idea that Wilder was helping you? She wasn't the only one. This game is just as cool the second time because... <sighs> Nothing. Lights are out across the whole damn campus. Somebody cut the power. This was supposed to be a quiet... Joyce! Who do you think you are? Go! Now! Move around! I can't be as ballsy on this difficulty. I gotta be a little more cautious. Gotta yeah, play it smart. Thanks for the heads up. Circle! Oh crap! There we go. Damn it! Get down. Gotta move. I can't. This is the one thing I don't like about playing games on the hardest difficulty. You have to sit back and wait for them to do stupid crap like that. Because I can't run up there. I can't run up there and just challenge this guy. Because I'm pretty sure I'll get killed every time. Well. I think we're good. Okay, there are guys down here. Trying to just get that guy dead first. They probably, yeah. You're outnumbered. I'm wounded. I'm empty. Oh shit! There's a guy behind me. Uh, hold on. Everybody calm down. See, that's the problem. That's something that happened to me a lot in the first playthrough, is I'd get caught fighting one enemy and have him come up behind me. I'm just gonna die. I think I'm gonna die every time on okay, hard if that happens. I don't think it's gonna be as forgiving as normal when I make mistakes like that and get caught watching One Direction. Okay, where am I? No time to lose. I gotta get to Will. I'm gonna use that ability here? to get around faster. I need to return some fucking books. HQ, we've got William Joyce in the library. <laughs> Waiting orders. Over. Will. They took him to the library. 
I gotta find a way in. I gotta get to him fast. Wait, no, that the port of hot is the way in. Okay. That looks this like is good. Off. I know how to do most of these puzzles now. Come on, I don't have time for this. Yeah, I forgot about this. Got a time. I gotta slow that time. thing down somehow. What the? Nailed what it. the glitch? This is Airlift Prime. We've got the Time Machine core in transit. Hey! Hands where I can suck! Beth Wilder. What the hell is going on around here? Best saving my ass. I am not looking forward HQ, to. We've got William Joyce in the library. <laughs> Awaiting orders. They got him. Over. I wonder where the brother is. The skeleton crew and wait for arrival of Monarch Actual. Everybody else needs to reunite at the Dry Docks Cronin Extraction Grounds. Wait for further orders. Stay sharp. The library is set to blow in five minutes. <laughs> Okay, I thought my bullets would be able to go through him. But I guess that's not... I don't want the heavy pistol, I want the ammo. Okay, I gotta jump down. What am I doing? <laughs> this game is actually harder at the beginning at points because you don't have all the abilities you do. Jack, run! Like, it actually gets a little... The middle of the game is easier than the beginning or the end. The, be, the beginning is is only hard because you don't have some of the abilities that make it really easy in the middle of the game. The end is obviously the hardest, but the beginning is harder than the middle part. Oh, God, what am I doing? I'm trying to... I wish there was, like, a cover system. I'm empty! Like, we're... I'm engaging! There's nothing I can do here. Advancing on target! Need. Okay, at least one guy's dead. Frag out! Okay, hold on, let me try to play the. Time to move. Let me try to play these camera angles. I don't know where I'm getting shot from. Is there a guy behind me? No, I don't know how I was getting Gotta hit move. by that guy. These guys in their nades. Calm down. down. You know what? The harder difficulty is all about. Just get headshots. Like if you get headshots this game. Relatively easy, a lot easier. Flanking. But I'm, I'm never running. gonna say like headshots are easy, especially if you're trying to aim Catch for them. This. They're like a hundred times harder if you're trying to That's purposely aim for them. Incoming. Using the stupid lights as cover. Will, you all right? You're fine. Okay. I got a One whole new the... batch of messed up shit. I need you to explain. Oh, there was ammo. Get me here. out of here first. We have to hurry. Where's my car? I didn't like the color. Let's get a new one. What? No, Jack. I need the. Uh. Hold that thought. My briefcase was in that car. I'll take you shopping. It's a fucking briefcase. A briefcase that contains something I need in order to stop the fracture. 
And you didn't think to spell that out to me before. I'm getting busy getting kidnapped. Yeah, well, it's not too late to leave you here. How the are you staying alive? That's part of the messed up shit I need explained. You got any theories about being able to manipulate time? No. Time to come up with one. Why are they still shooting? They said they wanted to take us alive. I think they changed their minds. What are you doing, buddy? Oh, I, I just like choked the end of the clip. What am I doing? Where is this? Oh, there he is. They always push here at this point. I don't get it. Like, I get I have the high ground, but... They would be better off to just wait. For me. They had me they pinned. Then we find Beth Wilder. Why? Who is she? She knows about the fracture. I trust her. Glad you trusted somebody. All right, let's it's go. It's not that simple, Jack. They kept secrets from you to keep you safe. Safe? Look around you, Will. Does this feel safe to you? This isn't my fault. Beth warned me this would happen. I did everything in my power to stop it. But you never told me any of this. I couldn't just... How long have you known? We don't have time for this now, Jack. We have to get to that briefcase. Let's move before more of them show up. I'm already to the second door, Will. Jack! Paul? Jack, we gotta go. Hold on. I'm sorry, Jack. Paul, what happened to you? What are you doing? Only what's necessary. Think about this. You don't know what's at stake. I know exactly what's at stake. That's why I'm here. You believe you can stop what's coming? I'm giving you one chance to change your mind. This path, it's already said it can't be changed. The past, the future, uh, uh, I've seen it. Uh, I've lived it for 17 years. 17 years. It was you, the first experiment. Come with me and we can see this through. Or hold on to your hope and burn with it. Now listen, I built a device. I can stop this. I can. You can't. This is madness. There's no harm in trying. There is. That's why I can't risk you opposing me, Will. It doesn't have to end like this. We can't just let this happen. I'll never stop trying. It took me years to come to terms with what must be done. But we don't have years. Wait, wait, wait. <sighs> Trigger. I never wanted this. No! You're not going anywhere. Well, there's the end to Act 1. So now it's time to make our choice. So I will go ahead and do this in the, uh, what am I trying to say? I'll try to do this in this episode. My name is Paul Serene. I founded Monarch Solutions 17 years ago with a very clear purpose. There are those who would question my actions. I'm recording this as a final statement of vindication, a testimony of how things came to be. 
I've always been devoted to my mission. Never deterred from my goal, no matter the sacrifice. Because I've seen where this leads. I've seen where it all ends. We have a problem. No word from Jack Joyce's transport. It should have arrived here by now. We may have a traitor on the inside. You're due for your treatment. I'll find who's behind this. Find Jack. That's our priority. Get your best man on it. There's more. As you know, Jack's level of interference led to unexpected complications. Witnesses from the university were transported here. You need to take a look. We can't afford any further obstacles at this stage of the plan. Now, I see two options. We could use force, remove any loose ends. But if those witnesses disappear, the public will start asking questions, potentially turn on Monarch. Alternatively, I could mount a broad PR strategy, clear, get the city on our side. But that leaves us with the... The loose ends. Precisely. The choice is yours, but keep in mind, the men will view your decision as a unified strategy moving forward. You know what? I I forget I forget which choice I made. Well, um. Well, while I we, see. sir, who is this? Amy Ferrero. She's one of the witnesses. Awaiting your orders and how to proceed. Well, wow, this is embarrassing that I that I forgot. Um. Oh, I have to act. I have to talk. Okay. My, My powers grew stronger, even as the Cronon Syndrome worsened. I could choose a path that would become the actual future, but it wasn't optional. The moment wouldn't end until I made up my mind. Okay, junction point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We'll, we'll look at them both. Any potential threats to our plan need to be erased. Wait! Monarch would take a hardline approach. Crush all obstacles, eliminate all witnesses. It would be harsh. But I had made hard choices for the greater good before. I dug through the area and I found everything I could on your bro. This is messed up, man. I trusted Monarch. But the people of Riverport would turn against us. Our secrets would be safe, but the public would hate us, and Jack would gain new allies. Monarch's got no authority to stop you, and you tell that to everybody on that bridge. Initialize a PR campaign. I want a statement. And that violence was because of Jack Joyce. Monarch would take a PR-friendly approach and manipulate the public into siding with us. Our lies would give us control. The manhunt continues as authorities search for Jack Joyce. Hey, somebody sneak around down there. Hey, I think that's Jack Joyce! We'd use the media to expose, then hunt for Jack. I uploaded all the files I stole on that USB stick from the Monarch security station. But the eyewitnesses would be out there, and Jack would learn our secrets. Okay, it was PR that we chose. Now, I, I, I was going to go back and look, but then I, I remembered. It, it is... PR is the one we chose. We chose... So we're picking a hard line this time. We're taking the hard line. Any potential threats to our plan need to be erased. Take her and the others to the Ground Zero operation. Make it quick. Painless. No! Wait! Please! Jack! 
There's no other way out. I'm going through the machine. Oh, wait. No! Jack! This way! Jack! I use my power to guide us. To decide how to best prepare for the inevitable end of time. That gives the chosen few a chance to survive. I've seen the end of time. All right, so Hardline. Two friends out of five, I think that means, chose Hardline. Uh, and 30% of the community chose Hardline. Um, I chose, I'm not even going to explain why I chose what I did in this series, in this playthrough, because if you watch, the, it's just the opposite choices of what I made in my last playthrough. Uh, but that is going to do it for this episode, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. In the next one, we will be firing up the, uh, the live, which is what I'm most excited for in this playthrough. I'm excited for the achievements, about 130 G, and the live action shows. That's that's what I'm most hyped for in this playthrough. Uh, but I hope you guys enjoyed this episode, and I will catch you all in the next one. Peace out.